You see, a lot of you know about post not clarity. You may have suffered a relapse in the past. And then all of a sudden, you gain back the logical part of your brain. Now, what is post not clarity? Post not clarity is a term used to describe the immediate clear mindfulness or clear mindedness, I should say, or soberness in individual gains after an orgasm. It is a state where one's mind becomes clear and free of distracting thoughts or emotions or any lustful thoughts. Now this process happens when you released on your own or with a woman that you slept with, right? You start to question yourself, why did you have sex with this woman? Or why did I just defile my body through masturbation? You ask yourself, was it really worth five seconds of pleasure? See, knowing you let porn get the best of you and the lust of the flesh consume you and now the clear and now with clarity kicking in you realize it wasn't worth it you realize that pleasure wasn't worth it at all it's you realizing that you could have found ways you could have found different ways to keep yourself productive throughout the day you think to yourself, man, I could have really prioritized my 24 hours and I could have utilized this energy to develop my life in all different areas. See, whenever we get that excitement in our genitals, we have to master delayed gratification, meaning to set aside the pleasures of life for hard work, and commitment of being self-disciplined in our grinding years to later enjoy long-term gratification. And it's basically denying yourself to feel good because we all want to feel good, but see, we're not willing to put, we're not willing to put in the work or sacrifice feeling good in order to attain success in our life because wanting to feel good is never going to amount to success. It's never going to amount to success. So you have to, you have to be, you have to be in a suffering place, a place where you are suffering where you are going through hell, where you are struggling, where you're going through pain. Because on your way to leveling up in life, it's not supposed to feel good. And a lot of people, a lot of young men, I should say, they want to feel good all the time. But you see, chasing, pursuing success is not supposed to feel good. Feeling good only happens when you actually get the results of your hard work. And to kind of switch the subject because now this is about this is about lust right this is about battling lust as well and when it comes to battling lust 
it comes down to what your eyes are exposed to. You know, the exotic images in the raunchy film that you're looking at, the pornographic content. And that is what, that's what's feeding your lust. You see, I've had a hard time battling lust in the past, in the past couple of years, because of how corn, because of how much corn I consumed. Lust was a reason why I would suffer a relapse, relapse after relapse after relapse. But I'm learning now to guard my vision and protect my eye gates from the devil's greatest weapon. And the devil's greatest weapon right now is P-O-R-N. That's right. The enemy has gotten a lot of us young men with P-O-R-N. And we have been enslaved and in bondage of this sin for so many years. And a lot of us have had a hard time breaking free. And you see, lust is in the eyes. It's in the mind, the heart, and the soul. But in order to exterminate the spirit of lust, you have to starve the demon of lust that is embedded inside you with consistent prayer, fasting, you have to seek the Lord for deliverance because he tells us to flee, not to fight. Don't, do not let, do not let lust take over your life. And having the post not clarity should be the reason why you should turn away from the demon of lust. Use that clarity to rebuke that demon from ever entering into your portal. Remember, the devil's weapon is pornography and lust. But the Bible states that let no weapon formed against you shall prosper. Meditate on that scripture every day and every night. So guys, with that being said, when you have a relapse, you will go through post not clarity. You will gain a clear mind. You will gain back the rational part of your mind. Because before... You're about to commit the sin of masturbation and watching the corn. Your brain is in a state of illogical thinking. You do not, you do not, you do not think clear. You are pretty much in a hypnosis of, of lust, right? And you're letting, you're letting your horniness get the best of you. But once you bust that nut, you can now think clear. You see the, you see the, 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 the ways, not the ways. You, you see how much, how much you messed up. You can see how much you sinned and understand that God is not impressed and God is not happy with what you just did. You're realizing that what you did was wrong. And now that it's over, you're able to move on from it. You're able to repent and turn away from that sin.
and to rebuke the spirit of lust. Because nine times out of 10, lust is going to lead into a relapse. Lust has made a lot of us dudes relapse. The desires of the flesh. With all these pixelated images and all this pornographic content. And that and that is where our eye gates. That is where our, that is where our eyes are turned to. Right. And our eyes. Are not guarded. Our eyes are exposed to this exotic and pixelated artificial stimulation. And our eye and our eye gates are suffering from from this demonic content that we are looking at. This unholy content, I should say. And when it comes to battling lust, we need to protect our eye gates, man. And always practice retention. Because practicing retention will get you closer to the most high. Retaining your life force will be the reason why you level up. But we must turn away from lust. We must turn away from the corn, masturbation, all that. It's not healthy. It's not productive. And it's, it's never, it's always going to manifest bad luck in our life. And we're, and we are, and we are put, we are putting ourselves into sin every time. And we got to get out of this cycle, man. But you, but let, po, but let post not clarity. Let post not clarity be the reason why you turn away from the sin. Because that's the clarity of mind that you need to have every single day. Every single day. And once and once you bust that nut, you should never want to do it again until until you are procreating with a woman. Until you are with a woman that you plan on having children with. That's the only time. So that being said, guys, I deleted this video once before. I talked about this a year and a half ago about post nut clarity. It got hit with a copyright strike, took it down. And want to re up and want to re upload it, but this topic had to be discussed. So that being said, hopefully this message helped you guys in any way. Like for the algorithm, subscribe today for more content. And this is Mr. Celodolo, and I'm out.